51-year-old native of Burke, Virginia. Has got Carolina at 6-2 after three straight wins. And away we go as Mike Graham and Armando Baycott get us started here tonight. Seven to shoot and Burford. Here's Torrance Watson, the Missouri transfer with the heave and hope and the 18th triple of the year. Watson, Burford, Hannah, and Michael Graham, the sophomore who handles it here. Watson in the corner, Hannah the lefty three. Phoenix out of the gate and buried two triples. Woods has checked in, he's wearing 25 for the Phoenix. Into traffic, there goes Torrance Watson and Graham will follow. Now Watson behind the back, into traffic, tried to bounce it. Graham the catch and flush. This is McIntosh. Taken away, here's Caleb Love. Caleb Love will be playing for a paycheck when he leaves North Carolina. Andrew Junk and a Mississippi State transfer is out there for Mike Schrage, but Davis has the pick and the layup. First points for R.J. Davis. High poster is Junkin. Leans in, left hand turn, good. Andrew Junkin's third field goal of the year. Walton and Manick. And Love fill out the lineup. Here is Junkin turning on Manick. Back with the left hand, Andrew Junkin a pair of field goals. You have to push him out of the paint. He's just bulldogging down and then trying to throw up a left-handed hook. It's a two by Garcia. Played only 13 minutes, though, in Sunday's win in Atlanta against Georgia Tech. Burford, that would have been a travel a year ago. It's a basket this year. They go to the decks to try and make the save, and finally it's Leaky Black who saves it to Walton. Love spot up. Garcia, the follow those 50-50 balls, I'm telling you, those add up at the end of the game. Great hustle by Leaky Black. Burford inside off the dribble. 19-18 after Garcia bought one of two, has six. By the way, his first field goal was changed to a three. There's a strong drive by Zach Urban, the junior from Gate City, Virginia, for his first points. Burford thought about it. Gets in traffic and then turned it over. Trying to feed Graham. Here's Davis the other way. R.J. Davis, tough shot for his second field goal. Or in your half sport sets, get the ball in the paint. Woods a three. Black skies for the rebound. Davis, three ball. Picked it up about five minutes ago, the second one. So Hubert Davis doesn't really have another long player in his lineup. Here's Graham, and he wraps around for his third field goal. Here's Walton, turned over, Burford, open floor, he'll set it down. Half dozen for Darius Burford. It's just crazy how yeah. high he's getting up. Love, in the traffic, scoop with the right hand. Back for Garcia's lefty three. They want to check it. Still just a six-point game. Long three, McIntosh. First points for Hunter McIntosh. Boy, Mike Schrage really want his team there to have that rebound. Caleb Love can't finish. Maddox follow good. Third try to charge. First field goal for Hera, Oklahoma's Brady Maddox. Watson, the Missouri transfer, fighting through and scores. Had the first bucket of the game. Now has five in the first half. And now here's Caleb Love. Hannah on the handoff tries to defend. The fall away is clean. Wow. I said, and I'll say it again, when he leaves, he's going to be playing for a paycheck. Uh, he's hitting a jumper going away from the basket. Guy draped over him. He made it look easy. What a tough shot from Burford. Baycott, double team there. Crosses for Davis on the hard drive and one. That's when Caleb Love's got to make a better decision on that. McIntosh the triple. 
Both of his field goals are threes, huh? Now yeah, the Packer guy really talented. Take it away. Here is Armando for the dunk. There's Hunter McIntosh teeing one up in front. Three threes for McIntosh. High ball screen, you have to communicate if you're North Carolina. Love launching and hitting. 16 for Love. Now to Love and Leaky Black. Five to shoot. That is from the western part of the state for Caleb Love. Hubert Davis talked about that was the benefit he had playing against and playing with a guy like Jeff Lebo in practice. Yep. Zach Irvin, his second field goal tonight. Trying to work off the screen of Graham. Hunter McIntosh drops on his fourth field goal. He's got 11. Here's Manic with Woods defending. And Baycott left all alone. Six all in the second half for Armando Baycott. And I think a big reason for their improved three-point shooting numbers, he gives them a legit low post presence. McIntosh has got 10 of Elon's 14 second half points. Baycott thought about the long two, puts it on the deck and scores against Graham. Big 10 challenge win. Garcia. Turns and rolls in one. Fourth field goal for Dawson Garcia. Uh, they have high praise for him, the coaching staff. Garcia can't finish the first time. Second one perfect. Lead 19 with eight minutes to go. Irvin fires over Baycott and hits. Zach Irvin with seven. Watson, nice pass, Hanna the catch and score. Just the second field goal for Chuck Hanna, but nice playmaking by Elon. Well, he's shown some flashes. There's Maddock inside for the dunk. And we're expecting McIntosh and maybe Burford to supply the scoring. And there's Darius Burford on cue. He's in double figures now with 10. A lot of contact. Here's Garcia. He'll finally squeeze away from Hannah and lay it in. The finals of the CAA, and they finished with a 10 and 9 overall mark. And this is year three. Here's Love, a deep three. Good heavens. 22 tonight for Love. Inside of four, Burford wheeling around Dunn, now caught in the double team. Leaves it for Wooten's three. Sure. Chris Wooten's ninth three of the year. I'm just telling you. Leaky Black on the board with two. By the way, they played on a regular basis, by the way, until about 1950. And then they took about a 60-year hiatus in the series. Double team in the backcourt. And knocked away. Here is McIntosh. A shot fake and tees up a three. Got it. Uh, I'm not going to go there. I'm a little ashamed, but I kept trying. Dewey Ferris. First field goal of the year. Ball got knocked away. Clark into the corner. Here's Sam Sherry for three. And Watkins the rebound. And the ball game will end. Carolina's now won the last 14 meetings with Elon.